but I'm a, I'm a practical man, you know. I wouldn't wear sunglasses indoors for no good reason. If you see a rogue and it doesn't have Baku in it, you probably think it's Kingsbane. That might be why he uh, gave me the old extraordinary there. Oh, uh, I hope it's not going to be one of those games. I hope he's just like disconnected briefly. I really hope. <laughs> I really hope he's not going to rope me every time because he just doesn't like Kingsbane. It's just that the uh, the, the pre-extraordinary emote made me think otherwise. No, no. I mean, he could he could be having internet issues. Oh no, okay, he ended the turn. Fair, fair play. All right. Nah, it's all right. Uh, false alarm. Lovely day though today. Not only am I enjoying Hearthstone, I'm also, also getting a tan. I'm also getting a tan. <laughs> oh, mate, you think I'm Kingsbane Rogue? <laughs> Oh, uh, you can rope me now. Yeah, no. Surprise. I'm not. <laughs> Beautiful. I have no time for games. Oh hell yeah. You thought you were getting a completely different deck, didn't you? Why not backstab? Oh, push 8. Oh, it's a good explanation. It's too early, I think, just to push damage. Like, the Abyss Rate's perfect for face damage later on. Uh, it's very unlikely that he can deal with Lich King after ratting it on the next turn. So it's uh I, I think it's it's probably best not to do that. Oh no, it's right. I was I wasn't um I wasn't having a go or anything, I'll just uh explain. Um Yeah. Element of surprise, so it's pretty good. When, when your opponent doesn't know what your deck is, then he can just he just he feels comfortable ratting <laughs> when he's got no backup to it. Uh, okay, I still think he was pretty salty though. Tis the same big priest. Uh, I'm gonna keep sap because we know where he is, and I'll keep Barnes. Uh, what's our win rate with this current version? Seven and one? Wow, seven wins, one loss. With this version with Shadow Blade. That's really good. Ah, uh, on the Twitch app doesn't work. Um, I will copy and paste that in for you then. Um, one sec. Does that copy and paste function work for me? It does not. <laughs> Uh, can someone, um, sorry, can someone in chat copy and paste the innkeeper code for, um, for uh, BF, or TBF? Tonight. Flashbacks for him. Fla nice one, nice one, Castle. Oh no, someone's copied and pasted it for you, dude. It'll, um... It's, it's, it's the same core cards, but, uh... I've been trying to swap out early game stuff to try to find, like, the best... Um... The best setup for it. I haven't been able to find... Find it just yet. Oh, that's interesting. He's not going for an attack here. But what I will do is I'll play Rivendare out, and then... I'm not too sure what he does to this board. I don't know if he's waiting for like a silence effect or what, but I don't mind copying Rivendur back because I think I play Rivendur and Eviscerate on the same turn and that'll pull out two Yasarajas and that'll give me like two giant minions after that, or potentially giant minions. And if you cut, it comes before a Psychic Scream turn on turn six. So I like... I waste... 
I like a shadow strike instead of wasting the vis root for damage later, so that's perfectly fine. So let's pull up two dudes. And then we laugh. And we see Lich. That scientist. Ah well, 50-50. One for one. Pretty nice, eh? Pretty nice. And we get in there just before psychic. Oh the light bomb. That's fairly brutal though. It's a fairly brutal light bomb. What we want to do then is we want to try trigger Sonya. How many? Uh, oh, this is our last secret. We want to try get Sonya to. We don't mind that. That's fine. We want him to play something so we can use Sonya. Okay, that's fine. How much damage do I got? Do I have here? Um, quite a bit. Not quite there yet. Eight from hand. Okay. Turn eight is when he's going to want to try play something, and we can manipulate a really good turn if he. Yeah, we can. If he just plays like a Lich King out here, we can manipulate a really good turn. Tonight, a tale of long lost words. This one turned out nicely. Wow, I'm stunned. I'm st I'm stunned. He runs Dollmaster. <laughs> uh, is that lethal? Hold on. Uh, six, nine, ten. Double eviscerate, yeah. Well, it was it was interesting that he runs that he runs the master breeze. Uh, he's dead. Sorry, lion. But what are you doing? <laughs> That's a good hand. Uh, I'm gonna have to rope this turn for one second. Come here. Don't you, don't you jump up there. Get, get down. <laughs> no turn free play, so I'll go face, because I'll probably have to re weapon. Oh, you did it, didn't you? Hey, come here. Crazy cat. He's after he's after some like bits on the top there. It's like him He's hyperactive now. No. Justice is mine. Eh? Ah, <sighs> all right. He's just he's just gonna have to do his uh, do his thing for a little bit then, I guess. More fighting his mill. Oh, King's main. Okay. Oh wait, he's got another shadow step there. Alright, I will defeat you, Rogue. Surprised he's not asleep. He usually wakes up in the middle of the night and sleeps during the day. He's surprisingly hyperactive for 9am. <laughs> Yeah, 
Yeah, Sylvanas surprisingly in this match it didn't do anything. So, I'll just trade it. Uh, I'll still play this and this again. So get more stuff up. I have to try pressure him before he gets like steel. Because he did two he did like two Oracle turns, he's definitely got like saps and uh he's he's highly likely to have saps and vanishes. So And he got the uh, this leeching poison. Oh by the way, so the people that said that this is a bad uh, a bad matchup against like mid range and you know, aggro. God damn it! I tried it out for myself uh, offline yesterday, and it doesn't. I I I was I was crushing even shaman and paladins with with very little effort with this deck. So. He's, he's he's playing with a with this and with, with a like a makeup applier, like a sponge. Bloody cat! What have we got in the deck? Shredder, Katie, Yasaraj, Sonya, and a scientist. Hey. Some good stuff actually. So we'll play this first. Oh, I pulled the worst one. Why did I even say the word scientist? It just jinxed myself. <laughs> oh, they're terrible. Uh, yeah, this this Kingsbane deck. I, I played against an odd paladin as well. I only played against one odd paladin when I played Kingsbane, and it, it wasn't even it wasn't even close. I got the weapon and leech up. And that, and uh, found out the dude was done. What? I'd say that's a very small sample size, though. I, it was only one of them, but I played a lot, a lot against the uh, even shaman with no problems. Tonight, a tale of Come, try luck. Is mine. great. I wish there was a fly in the living room, you could go chase that one around the place. Right, right now I'm worried because I, I I've got to close the window because I'm worried that he might like try to jump out the window. So I've got to I've got to close the window now. So it's, it's, it's extra hot. Yeah, can't do anything against this weapon. I tested it because loads of people in chat yesterday were telling me that this 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 deck isn't isn't great. It only has like a, a sub like someone even said yesterday like a thirty percent win rate. Thirty. It definitely has a higher win rate than 30%. <laughs> it, it's... It's good. It's it's really good. And it, it's it, it's gonna get... It's gonna get a tech card printed against it, I'm sure. It's gonna happen. It's gonna happen. Yeah, I mean the man. The, <laughs> I mean it's insane. Something will happen to this deck for sure. There's no way this can uh, this can carry on the way it is. There's nothing left, is there? Just needs. Oh, there's a taunt. There's a taunt that's gonna get sapped and then I'm gonna get punched in the face and then something else is gonna go on top of it like an eviscerate or something like that. Um, now is there any way I can lethal him from this turn? <laughs> How many rags do I need to kill him? I'd need four, uh, four right? Yeah, there's no way. The 
whole the whole wild set's ridiculous, so it's okay. Yeah, but these ridiculous decks that you have in wild have tech cards, neutral ones you can put in to kind of disrupt them. Like, uh, um, so I'll, I'll, I'll get back to you on that one. Like, rat. That's that's have a little think of what it is. Oh, the guy's even emoting me for a chance. Uh, what was I saying? Yeah, like, uh, like rat, rat from Malagos, and, um, um, Togwaggle Druids, right? Um, Geist for Jade Druids. I mean, these, these things have all got tech cards in it, uh, to disrupt, you know, these types of decks. Whereas this, this deck has no, no real, uh, disruptive power. Why was he emoting me like that? He didn't even have lethal. How much damage is that? Oh, it's lethal. Well, isn't that something, eh? I don't know, maybe next time don't emote. Jackass. Oh yeah, oh yeah, you yeah. Incredible. But there's gotta be some sort of disruption for this deck overall. I don't think you can have some sort of auto win over one one other deck. I only won that because he, he obviously thought yeah, he obviously thought he had enough mana to... I think he BM'd me. That's what I think happened. I think he BM'd me. I think he played two... I think he played two uh, of the uh, bots, whatever those bots are called, to upgrade the weapon twice, which he didn't need to do. Then he did the uh, whirlwind effect, and then he forgot that uh, Cavern Finder and the weapon would cost three mana total. So I'm pretty sure he BM'd me there, and it backfired. I'll be. I'm all right with Kingsbane, right? The, I'll be alright with the deck as long as there's a tech. There's one tech card printed against it, and that's fine. I will, I, I, that'll be fine. Yeah.